Oh boys, I don't think I would have thought this park would really flood, but it's super close to it. We actually filmed part of a vlog right out there, kind of at that secondary tree line. So somebody just left a drone here. Not really sure. It looks like a DJI, but I'm not sure if it's a DJI or if it's a, a knockoff. Kind of looks more like a knockoff. Yeah, leave droney alone, I know. I've been brushing for what? You'd say 10 minutes? I set a timer for 15. It hasn't gone off yet, but I'd say we're getting close. And we're still getting lots off. We did try these gloves, which worked uh, pretty Way well. Than I thought they would. To be honest, I didn't have like high expectations, but it works really well. The only thing is it seems to make his, what were you saying, his coat a little more dull, it maybe? It makes his coat dull because it scratches up all the dander from underneath. Which I'm not sure if that's good or bad, but yeah, it definitely doesn't look as shiny. But you, he let me do his tail and his belly and everything. Hey, Lotus. That's Enzo's antler. And Lotus let me brush him, which Lotus is always a... Uh, he doesn't like to be brushed. Now, said, hey lady, don't do that. Good. Yeah. Good yeah. We don't shed very much, pup. <laughs> so that was like five scoops off of Lotus. <sighs> Just like this little baby bit. Oh. We haven't brushed Lotus much while we've been out here. Unlike Enzo, which we brushed a ton. In Enzo's defense, he is longer. That's five off of Enzo. <laughs> <laughs> After we've both brushed him quite a bit. He's been brushed a ton already, yeah. Alright, boys. <sighs> How about a butt shave while we're already oh, out here geez. doing this? Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. We're on, boys. <laughs> Hello. Good morning, YouTube. Welcome to the channel. Enzo. Oh, you finally livening up a little bit? Lotus. So now that the snow is officially melting, it has created a bit of a flooding situation, which you will see in today's vlog as we try and... You get it? Anyways, as we try and fail mostly to find a park that isn't underwater, uh, we do find one eventually, so I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. God bless you, and we'll see you in a bit. It's really amazing how I can forget that this water, or that this park is going to be underwater because I call it the underwater park for a reason. And yet I still manage to forget. That might be the highest I've ever seen it. That's impressive. You can see those buildings out there. I don't know that I'm gonna let them run in the river, but you know, you do you. Well, I decided we'd head back to the highway, but apparently that road is closed. As is that way. So yeah. Hmm. Sorry boys, it's coming, becoming difficult. Literally went to the top. Third time's the charm, boys. That's the airport. What you think? Yeah, I know. You pilot, I know. It's a little bit underwater. Not all of it. I mean, you can still land and fly, I guess. Oh, they are totally going to take off, too. Just a little water. Think of that plane. Lotus, you cannot fly. You keep saying that. You're fucking crazy. You're crazy. And then as far as the underwater park goes, see that lake there? That would be the underwater park. Yeah, I know, it's sunk. I know, what the pup? What the pup? Oh, getting too hot for you? You need to move north, move to the mountains, yeah. Not happening. It's been nice and warm the last couple days, but I'm really surprised how dry this trail is. I wanted to avoid hiking because I just figured everything would still be a muddy mess. But there was like one teensy tiny spot that I healed him around it. I ended up stepping in mud. Um, but other than that, it's been good. Off. Keep it moving. Go on. 
Well, we looked out and the trails are back open. This was the trail that was closed not too long ago. I know, they fixed it, huh? Yeah. If you recall, Enzo was like right here. And we were covered in snow and that was just a couple weeks ago. We hit the end of the road on this one. They don't need your help. No, they don't need pup assistance. Sometimes when we're... Sometimes when we're out vlogging, I will just strap a GoPro to my chest, to my backpack, and film. As you can probably imagine, that creates a lot of footage that gets edited significantly down. But you guys are always like, oh, we want to see all of it, we want to see all of it. So since this video was a little bit shorter, I figured, hey, a few weeks back we did a snow vlog. We did several snow vlogs, but one in particular had like this very long cut scene where like we were hiking and everything that I cut way, way down. But I kept the first draft as you will, uh, basically the full version and stuff. So for those of you who just love to see the pups out and about playing in the snow and hiking, that's what you're about to see is basically before all the snow melted and we got all the flooding, you could see what all that snow looked like. As far as like the vlog goes, that's pretty much gonna do it right here though. Appreciate you guys as always, and we'll see you on the next one. Well, it's a good thing we got the four wheel. Otherwise, I don't know, we'd be getting to the park today. You're gonna be real upset if I leave you in here because you not behave. You just got in trouble and I missed it on film. Enzo, that's too loud. You gonna come get us? I'll call the authorities. Oh. Okay. All right, let's go this way. Wow, wow, okay. I'd say there's at least a foot at this point, at some points, some places. Wow, you got the flopsy. Doom pup. Oh, that's a good boy. Lotus, watch out. Lotus, Lotus, come on. Jeez. Oh, All right, so made it to the trail. Haven't fallen yet, but we're gonna record the whole time just in case. I've only ever fallen one time on a hike with the pups. It was after it had kind of rained, I slipped, wasn't filming. Unlike yesterday, I made sure to wear just straight up snow gear, minus the shoes. I don't have boots. I do have some coming though. I ordered some. The pants come over my ankles. I have heated socks on, the shoes are waterproof, so really I'm fine. Or not water resistant, they're waterproof. Do you pups even care about my shoes? Jeez. I don't know if wifey can see us, but she can definitely hear us, I'm sure. I'm coming as fast as I can. <laughs> Do I hit another trail? Come on. I'm going to the trail. Come on, I haven't fallen yet. I think they're confused by me walking backwards. <laughs> Even Lotus went the right way. Jeez, Enzo, you're off the chain today. Doesn't look like anybody's been on this trail recently. It's all recovered in snow. I think we'll be able to do the whole thing too because somebody broke some glass at, towards the end. It's not a lot, but it's enough that like I didn't want to risk it with them. So we always turn around like part way. Today, it'll be under a foot of snow. So I think we'll be all right. Plus it's a really steep hill. So I'm almost guaranteed to fall. I could see tracks from, a, it looks like maybe a couple days ago, but the, honestly, they're so light. Those might be like deer tracks. Yep, I should just follow your guys' path. I know, what am I thinking? I'm sorry, I'm going as fast as I can. Oh, stop for a snow break. Stop for a snow cone. Lotus, stay up here, buddy. All right, quite the hill to make it up. Buddy, I think Lotus is about to attack. Are you ready? What are you doing there, Pop? Oh, maybe not. Oh, you wasn't gonna attack? No, you just friendly, Pup. Oh, that's sweet. So the pups told me that they get the impression that I've uh, clickbaited you guys into thinking I was gonna fall and I haven't fallen yet so that we should do another little hike to see if I can fall. 
They said it's not fair. So I guess we're gonna go do another little one. Well, bye. He keeps trying to get these sticks and they're like frozen down there. Oh, did you finally get one? About time you tried to get that one, it wouldn't come. Don't worry about mom, she'll be okay. She's toasty. Unlike Lotus, who looks like he's frozen. Oh, close. Oh, you see that bird? Is that an owl? Yeah, that's totally an owl up there. We're on the GoPro, so I doubt you're gonna be able to see it, but 100% an owl. Lotus is infatuated. Those little baby owls? Oh my gosh. Nisha's gonna die that she missed that. Too far. Oh, good boys. Yeah, I couldn't see you up there. I'm trying to go as fast as I can. We will not be playing fetch today. Learned our lesson the hard way yesterday. Didn't really think that went through, boys. My bad. We lost preciouses. Oh yeah, this is gonna be where I fall. 100%. All right, my hand touched, but that's not technically a fall yet. My knee was not down. That's the rule. Boy, it's too far. Come. Took us 25 minutes to do that. Normally it takes us about 15. <sighs> I haven't fallen. Can't help it that I'm just this awesome at coordination. I'll teach you boys. Why? Why? just love the snow. Well, we had almost 10 inches the other day. We got at least another couple last night, so I'd say, plus it's been snowing the last couple hours. I'd say it's easy that we're at a foot. Oh, they're running the mom. See, you can tell the difference. They don't normally run that far from me. I mean, you guys watch the videos. Do you ever see them run that far from me? No, only if wifey's in the car. It's the only time. The boys said it was false advertisement because well, people, I was probably gonna fall in it if it fell. the star. No. Have you lost your mind? 